All right, this is for um, people that are getting an error like this on uh, the DZSA launcher or something similar, where it says the server has a more recent version. That's for some reason, it, you'll get that error when using DZSA launcher, but you won't when getting when using the vanilla launcher. Um, but for those who do want to use DZSA and prefer that um, as their launcher, this is how you can fix that. So, for example, here we are, we're having the expansion bundle. Um, that is the issue. I'm actually already downloading that now, but I will show you what to do if you get this issue. So, you're going to open your launcher. Um, you're going to go to your mods. All right. You'll see here are all the mods that you have subscribed to. So, what you're going to want to do is um, let's find a mod that I'm currently uh, subscribed to. Let's say expansion. Um, okay, AI. That's kind of a small mod. All right. So, what you want to do is you're going to let's say this is the the, the mod that you were going to you were getting the error with. Okay, it was moaning about Daisy expansion AI. That is um, a different version. So, what you want to go do is find the the mod. And you're going to go here and click on unsubscribe okay what you could what you could even do is you can go and um open it up it'll take you to where the the mod is that's the mod right there okay you can shift delete that okay it'll delete the mod out of your um, mod library and then um uh, you'll see it'll say expansion ai pending um, so if it stays pending like that, what you want to do is then go and just hit the re uh, verify uh, button. You can go and just unsubscribe from the mod, but that means you're going to have to go and open your Steam, and you're going to have to go. Um, you're going to have to go and find the mod, and you're going to have to subscribe to it again. Okay, so it's easier to delete it that way. All right, so it's if it stays in this pending and you're just going to go hit the refresh and if that doesn't work like a lot of the times it doesn't um you're going to oh there we go never mind you just have to give it a moment sometimes then it's going to start downloading that mod again from scratch so as you can see here um i had to do the exact same thing for expansion bundle because the exp it, it would work fine for the vanilla launcher um which is this is the vanilla launcher it works fine but it wouldn't through this so um i i've deleted it and it is now re-downloading from scratch once that is downloaded again you'll be able to connect to the vanilla launcher again yeah that's all that's all um if you do have any other issues with connecting um let us know create create a ticket or um just to get the attention of one of the admins or mods and we'll be more than um more than happy to assist you with that Thank you. Cheers. Yeti out.